Come with me as I take you on a dinosaur dig. Our days start out early to beat the heat out in the field. You can see us prepping for the day. We usually gather our supplies and are out by about 7.30 in the morning. It usually takes us about an hour to get to our specific field locations, but the drive-in is almost always just beautiful and relaxing, and sometimes you can even see some cattle. After we park the cars, we use a GPS to find our specific locations. Today, we were working on some macro sites, which just means the larger fossils that you find out in the field. Typically, these are dinosaurs. You can see here me removing some sediment around the fossil. The goal is for us to get these fossils ready to have them taken out of the site so they can be prepped at a museum. Again, I cannot tell you how absolutely beautiful the view is out here in eastern Montana. This is Ben. You can see him getting the fossil prepped for a jacket. And this is the plaster Paris that you typically see at these dig sites. We finished up a little early at this site and headed to a different location for the end of the day. I drank a ton of water today because the temperature was almost 100. At our next location, we prospected a little bit to see if there was anything new in the area. This is a sped up video of what it kind of looks like sometimes when we remove a bone. This is actually from an extant species. Around four o'clock, we wrapped everything up and started heading out. Again, you can see more cows on our drive back home. We did some screen washing, which is just where you take sediment and break it down using water to find smaller fossils. And I ended my day reading Riley Black's new book, The Shortest History of Dinosaurs. Stay tuned for more dinosaur content.